Hello, my fellow trucking friends. Hello, hello. It is Megan Maria, your independent truck couture designer. Happy Tuesday. Oh, I wanted to play a game. Darn it, I hit the live button too soon. Where did I put him? Oh my gosh, hang on. Hold the phone. I want to play a game tonight. We haven't played a game in so long. Where did I put him? Oh. Okay, there, there they are. Hang on. <laughs> Hang on, we're gonna play a game tonight. Because you know what? We need to have some fun, right? We haven't had fun in a long, well, okay, we have, and I need to figure out what makes me not have you guys jiggle so much. But we need to have some fun, so let's have some fun. We're gonna play a game tonight, so you're gonna wanna stick around. We are going to play Family Feud. We have not played Family Feud in so long, so I have my new set of Family Feud cards. Because um, we haven't played in a while, and I'm going to the post office, well, I'm trying to figure out how to mail from home. I figured out how to mail from home. I just haven't done it yet. So I'm trying to decide, is it worth risking just going to the post office or figuring it out? <laughs> I'm on the fence. So let's play a game. We're gonna play a game tonight. So in exchange for playing the game, what I do ask is that you do this. If you can do that, it helps me tremendously. So thank you, thank you. But we are gonna play a game just cause it's fun. And why shouldn't we, right? We should play games more often. I mean, I have friends that are playing like virtual um, game nights and they're like getting on Zoom and they're playing all these fun games together. And if you've never played Werewolves, you could, there's a whole app. You can play Werewolves on an app. I mean, Werewolves is a very fun game, but I am totally digressing. I should be talking about chalk, right? But we're going to play a game tonight. So if you could please do this, it does help me. It's not a requirement to play the game. Okay. It's just, if you feel so inclined to hit that button, it will help me while we play the game. Thank you, thank you, Miss Cheryl. So I want to stop and say hi to everybody. Um, oh, hey, Nicole from Nevada. I don't know, Nicole. You might have not. You might be a newer viewer since we've played games. So I'm gonna go over how we play a game. Hello, Nicole. Hello, Miss Carol. My favorite, favorite friend, Carol. I have two favorite, favorite friend, Carols. I have my favorite friend, Carol, and I have my favorite friend, Carol with an E. I try not to play favorites. <laughs> it's hard. Hello, Linda. Linda. Hello, Linda Squared. Hello, Miss Virginia. Hey, Lisa G. Welcome everybody. Okay, so this is how we play a game. We play Family Feud, and I ask you a question. I mean, for, for those of us, I mean, I think all generations have played Family Feud, haven't they? Depending on how old you are. Some of us are older than others. <clears throat> Try not to let that sink in too much. But I ask a Family Feud question, like the top 100 people surveyed and their top 10 answers are on the board, or their top five answers are on the board. And you have to guess what the top answers are. And the first person to guess the number one answer wins a prize. That's how easy this is. And it's so much fun because I love doing this. It's just so much fun. And we have not done this in a very long time. Ooh, Carol played Yahtzee with the grandkids. Did you, you I'm hoping you played it virtually. I'm sure you did because you, you commented how much you've been missing seeing them. So I'm sure you played it virtually. But... I'm all excited tonight because we're gonna play a game. <laughs> it's like, oh, human contact with real people. <laughs> I can't see you, but I just, I, I feel you. I know you're there, right? Right. Hey, Maddie, welcome to our chocolate party. We're playing a game. So how the game works is I ask you a question, top 100, whatever, it doesn't tell me how many people, but the top survey answers are on the board, the top five are on the board, you try to guess number one. Now these are my caveats. Understand Facebook. First of all, what I'm saying right now, you're not hearing for anywhere from 20 to 40 seconds after I say it, depending on my internet speed, your internet speed, and Facebook's discretion. So we play very fairly. I play very fairly. I watch my comments on my screen in front of me. I don't watch them on my phone because, again, they're two different speeds. I watch the ones on the, uh, well, actually, I do watch them both. I have to watch them both because sometimes this one's not up to date. So I'm going to watch them on my phone. I watch my comments on my phone. And I close my eyes. And then the first person that I see that says the right answer is the winner. So it may not be the first person you see. And it may not, you might not even see the person when I see it. So just understand, I play very fairly. Then the winners, I send a prize to. Because if I'm, you know what? If I am going to risk my life going to the post office, we might as well play some games and have some fun, right? I know. I'm like a little kid. I know, my husband tells me that all the time. 
Okay, oh, you did play it virtually. I bet that was fun to play Yahtzee virtually. Okay, so the thing that I ask in exchange for playing the game is if you could please do this. It does help me a lot, so thank you, thank you. I'm gonna not going to ask that again, so thank you. So, we're going to play a game. I'm going to ask you a question. We might as well, let's just start with the game, right? Who needs to chalk? Hello. Oh, Miss Vicky, you are in trouble. I'm, yeah, you're, you should be sorry you didn't call me back yet. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm going to come, I'm going to drive to Canada, Vicky. <laughs> I'm going to, okay, they won't let me cross the border, but I'm going to pretend. I'm totally wound up tonight. <sighs> okay, so. I have any, I should have picked out, I like to pick out questions that kind of at least apply to what we're doing. Ooh, and my glasses are not helping me today. Oh. Eh. I try to, you know, I try to have them be kind of fun. <laughs> this one is very good for social distancing. We might have to play that one. Ooh, that's a good one too. <laughs> These are okay. This this set of, this batch of cards is better than the last batch. We got more. I don't like that one. You know that's that's that one could be a little bit dirty. My phone has been ringing off the hook. Keep your blood pressure in check. All right, all right, Miss Vicky. Okay, I understand where I land on the totem pole. That's okay. I realize you have family <laughs> and people that you really actually know. <laughs> uh, Okay, we got some good ones. We got a couple good ones. And if we don't like them, you know what? We'll throw it away and get a new question. So we're going to start right off the bat. So the key to playing the game is, because it's a speed thing and it's a Facebook thing, type your answer more than once. And who is our fiesta type? See, this is how long it's been since we played. Oh, it's Cheryl. Cheryl types for a living. Cheryl is very good at typing her answer more than once. So just keep typing, 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 typing over and over and over again. Because the more you type, the more chances you have of me seeing it, okay? Because you can just totally bump the other person. So, if you are a designer, you cannot play. Well, you can play, but you can't win if you're a designer. This is only for customers. <laughs> I'm only sending prizes to customers, not other designers. <laughs> Which is kind of funny. All right, so I'm going to read a question. It's going to say the top... Okay, this one is very appropriate for social distancing and the conversation my husband and I had before I came down the stairs. <laughs> so I read the question and you're going to type your answer. The number one answer wins and it's the number one answer, the first number one answer I see. Keeping in mind that between this screen and my phone, I only see three to four, depending on how many sentences you type, three to four comments. So that's why you have to keep typing your answer because you'll, you'll bump the next person up. You can scroll. So you can increase your odds of winning the more you type your answer. It's a lot of explaining for it. I'm eight minutes into explaining and I'm just still talking about a game. Okay, you ready? Here we go. My eyes have gotten really bad down here. If you had fingers as fat, oh, hang on, I gotta turn my comments off. I forgot to do that. Okay, I turned my comments off. <laughs> I, gotta, whew, I tried to be really fair. If you had fingers as fat as hot dogs, name an activity that you might have trouble doing. <laughs> okay, so the conversation my husband and I had before I walked down the stairs is, I did not bake anything today. And he was, I think he was a little disappointed when he came home and there was nothing baked. I don't like to bake. I don't enjoy baking. I've baked something every day since our governor told me I had to stay home. <laughs> But I did not bake anything today. He was a little disappointed. So if you had fingers as fat as hot dogs, name an activity that you would have trouble doing. Oh, can you see that? Oh, you might have been able to see my answers. Hmm. I got to get better at that. In the meantime, I will also talk about chalk. I promise. <laughs> because I promised that we would talk about this absolutely gorgeous Aiden chalkboard this evening. So the Aiden chalkboard is our one of our gallery boards. It's gorgeous. I mean, in the world of chalkboards, this is like the pizza resistance. Okay, so I can see, I'm thinking, yep, okay. So you've had a little bit to type now, and I don't want you to just keep typing, typing, typing. So if you had fingers as fat as hot dogs, name an activity you might have trouble doing. Okay, so I'm going to turn our answers, our, my comments on. I'm going to close my eyes. Okay, ready? 
Name an activity you might have trouble doing if your fingers were as fat as hot dogs. Maddie says, oh, Maddie, you, you jumped already, Maddie. I didn't see it. Oh, wait, no, she's down here. Maddie says painting. Nope, that's not on here. Maddie says painting again. Vicki says threading a needle. Not on here. Linda says holding a needle. Eh, I'd go with sewing, but that's number three. Jennifer says typing. Woot, woot, Jennifer, you are our big winner. Woo-hoo, woo-hoo, Jennifer won. Woo-hoo, woo-hoo. The number one answer is typing. The number two answer is putting clothes on. Okay, I guess maybe. Sewing is number three. Number four is braiding or combing your hair. I don't know. And number five is picking up things. Ooh, Amanda said texting. That's a good one. I think my cards might be a little older than texting though, Amanda. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Typing. I would think typing and texting are kind of the same thing. So, Miss Jennifer, you are our big winner. And I have your address, my dear. So, I think I have your address. I'm, sh I'm sure I have. Yes, I do have your address because you're in the club. Jennifer. And you're our first winner. We'll play again. Don't worry. Because I love playing games. Playing games is fun. It's like the best part. <laughs> but we will chalk, too. I promise. I need people. <laughs> I'm so thankful that you people are here with me this evening. <laughs> okay, so let's talk chalk. So I'm an, <laughs> I'm making Maria. Wow, we're 11 minutes into then. I don't think I've said that enough. I am making Maria and I am a chalk couture independent designer, which is the best job in the whole wide world. Because first of all, during social dis distancing, I get to talk to you guys and it makes me sane. And I get to create beautiful things. I get to sell beautiful things. I get to do all kinds of fun things. <sighs> it's the best job. And this Aiden chalkboard is our gallery chalkboard. It's also one of our chalkboards that comes in our starter kit if you become a designer. And tomorrow, lots of things happen tomorrow that we need to talk about, which is why we have this chalkboard out. Tomorrow is April 1st. It's a brand new spanking new month. And in a brand new spanking new month, our chalk couture changes the designer kit. So tomorrow morning, I'm going to get news as to what the new items are in the designer kit. So if you've ever thought about being a designer, tomorrow morning is a great day because it's going to tell us what beautiful new transfers you get in your kit. They refresh it occasionally and tomorrow is a refresh day. One of the things that comes in your kit is this Aiden chalkboard. Now it only doesn't come in your kit. Anybody can buy this. You don't have to be a designer to have this chalkboard. But this chalkboard is a porcelain steel chalkboard. Because it's porcelain steel, it makes it magnetic. So, things stick to it. So you can embellish, it's a very strong magnet, I might add. You can embellish your chalk creations with magnets. So, like last night, let's see here, see our little cake stand that we made that I cut out with a scroll saw? And I said, Sage attaches hers with magnets. She attaches it with magnets to her Aiden board. I forgot to say that last night. So it's a beautiful chalkboard. It comes in three different sizes. It comes in this size, which is nine by 12, which is our A and B size transfer size. It comes in um, 18 by 12, which I just ordered myself one today because I don't have one of those, which will fit a C size transfer. And then it comes in the big behemoth one, which is the 12 by 24. Those are the gorgeous, big, big, big ones. Um, but it's a gorgeous chalkboard. So. I don't chalk on this often because, you know, it's like the good scissors. <laughs> when you have the good scissors, you save it for special occasions. And today I decided um, whatever millionth day of social distancing is a special occasion for Maria to pull up the big, beautiful chalkboard. So that is one of the reasons why we are using this chalkboard tonight is because it's one of the... Uh, chalkboards that comes in your kit if you choose to be a designer it's also um, a very nice size chalkboard and it's magnetic which is another really nice feature to it if you choose not to be a designer it's not crazy expensive I think I think it's $39.99 let's just confirm that I think that's its price Okay, where is it in my cat? 
color. There we go. Yep, it's $39.99. Um, and it's gorgeous. This is one of those that if you are a Club Couture member, it came also with your Kickstarter kit. So if you purchase a Kickstarter kit, if you be, when you become a um, Club Couture member, this is the chalkboard that you got in your Kickstarter kit. So I thought it would be fitting to put a Club Couture transfer on here. So a couple ways to get this chalkboard. Club Couture Kickstarter kit. Become a designer or just buy it off the website. There's three ways to buy this chalkboard. Um, tomorrow, being April 1st, is also the kickoff to the new Club Couture. So if you want to join Club Couture, today's the day to do it. If you want next month's transfer, on the 5th of the month, the transfers get mailed. So if you want April's, I can't even tell you what month it is anymore. If you want April's Club Couture transfer, you need to join today. Before midnight mountain time, which is like 2 o'clock in the morning our time. It's a crazy time. Or 1 o'clock in the morning. Somewhere, somewhere when we're all sleeping is mountain time at midnight. So if you want to join the club, which is $19.99 a month, and you get this beautiful transfer in three paste packets every month, like magic, delivered on your doorstep with free shipping. So it's truly just $19.99 a month. You can join now. April 5th, you get charged your $19.99 a month, and a transfer will come in the mail to you. You get an option to purchase this gorgeous surface if you choose to, but you don't have to because you don't. You can chalk on anything. You don't have to chalk on this absolutely gorgeous chalkboard. But that's the premise behind the club as well as chalk couture: that you buy a really nice chalkboard and then you change it every season <laughs> or every month when you get a new club couture. So every month when this beautiful package arrives in the mail, you're not wondering, "Oh my gosh, what am I going to create that on?" Well, you're going to wash off last month and you're going to put a new month on here. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to put our fun little home, which is two months ago, Club Couture Transfer, which is gorgeous. But instead of our wreath, we're going to stick our fun little magnetic flower. Because I love this little magnetic flower. It's one of my faves. I've had it for a long time, although I'm noticing he has a little chip in him. I'm not sure how he got that. Makes me a little depressed, but that's okay. So this is porcelain steel. This is not a Michaels chalkboard. This is not a boutique board, which is our other chalkboards. This is like glass. This is gorgeousness at its best. Um, high quality, all that good stuff, chalkboard. So because of that, you are going to fuzz your transfer. Well, what the heck is fuzzing? Because that's a crazy term, right? Fuzz. Like, here comes the fuzz. <laughs> okay, again, I'm dating myself. I understand that. And it's probably a derogatory term that's not politically correct. So I apologize to all police officers that are viewing. I, I, I mean no disrespect when I say that. Whew, I am on a roll today. But first we're going to do, we're going to apply lint to the back of our transfer. So I'm going to carefully remove my transfer from my backer sheet. You need to save this because you're going to put your transfer back on that. Now my transfer has been used many, many times. Last month when we got this transfer, you watched me use it over and over and over again. So it's not ridiculously sticky anymore, which is good to put it on this surface. So I'm going to fuzz it a few times, and then I'm going to place it on my board. And while I'm getting ready to chalk, let's play another game. Right? Okay. Ready? Everybody ready? Got your typing fingers ready? <laughs> this was kind of funny. This is how Maria feels today. Okay, you ready? So how this works is type your answer. Type it more than once because you bump the people. There are the top one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Top seven answer. Top seven answers are on the board. Ooh, shoot! I gotta stop doing this. So you guys can see the answer. I do need to get out, Linda. Linda, you're right. Oh, I, oh, sorry. You guys are making comments. Hey, Kathy K. Ooh, Maddie's B day is on Sunday, so Maddie's feeling lucky. Okay, ready? Name a way a monkey can probably tell that you are not a monkey. <laughs> Oh, I forgot to turn my comments off. <laughs> Name a way a monkey can tell that you are probably not a monkey. And while you're doing that, I'm going to push my transfer down and I'm going to start stirring up my chalk paste so that I can wait the 30 to 40 seconds before you actually even hear what I just said and then we can start uh, looking for answers. So I'm going to use two colors 
I was going to use, I think I am, I'm going to use Morning Sky, which is a very bright cherry blue, which I got to tell you, I kind of need today, a bright cherry blue. And then I think we're going to use almond. Um, I was thinking maybe white. And I'd ask you, but I have your comments <laughs> turned off. And if I look at the screen, I think I need to do white. I think it's too creamy. But it kind of goes with, eh, I think I might need to do white. All right, I'm going to wait because I want to know your answer. Or I wanna, after the question, then we'll ask. Okay, ready? Name a way a monkey can probably tell that you're another monkey. Okay, I'm going to turn my, oh, I got I to gotta look to turn my, turn my comments on. Turn my, ooh. Ooh, what did I do? Okay, hang on. All right, comments are on. Okay, ready? Name a way a monkey can probably tell that you're not a monkey. Carol says, because you don't have a tail. Ooh, that's a good one, Carol, but that's not on here. Linda Linda says, no bananas. <laughs> Unless it's banana bread with chocolate chips in it, but no, that's not on here either. Vicky says they sound like you. Nope. Or the sounds you make. Wow, no. There's seven answers on here, people. Come on. Linda Linda says... Oh, wait. How did I get that? Oh, Kathy K. Kathy K. Ding, 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 ding. You are the big winner. Smell. Smell, Kathy K, is the answer. Smell. Number one is smell. Number two is not hairy. <laughs> After we all spend two more months in our house, who knows? Number three is face. Number four is walk. Number five is wear clothes. Number six is different size. And number seven is not in a cage. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I'm just going to leave that one alone because I could have a little I could have. I could have a little fun with that whole not in a cage one. Okay. So, Kathy K is our big winner. Wow. Kathy K is local too. This is getting easy. Although, we're going to have to figure out how you're going to get your prizes. I can mail them or you guys. Well, Jen, you're not local, local. All right. Okay. We're going to talk and then we'll play one more time. Okay? Whew. All right. So, I'm pushing down my, my transfer. Do you think I should do white? Oh, yeah. Cindy. Yeah. No designers can win. The way you jump up and down, Vicky, are you funny? Okay, I gotta look at your answers just because it's funny. I can't swing from the trees. Touching you, oh, that's one way. Looks, smell, the sounds you make. Touching you, smell, 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 look. Touching you, smell, 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 smell. No bananas. You can't hang from trees, oh. You can't swing from trees. Okay, you guys have funny answers. Oh my gosh, you guys like answered a lot. Okay, wow. You guys got typing fingers. Holy cow. Are you a designer? I am a designer, Vicki. Are you? <laughs> Sorry. Vicki's a designer. I just have to. Whew, I, need to I need to get out. <laughs> I need to go to the post office. I need to risk my life for the post office. All right. So, are we thinking white would be better with our flower? Probably. So, white. Oh, well, you know what? What am I doing, white? I'm doing the home in blue, and I'm just doing welcome to our. Should our welcome to our be white or cream? Home is going to be blue with a cute little flower. Okay, you guys are talking to each other, I think, Cindy and Vicky. Because Vicky just said no. I don't know what Vicky's saying no to. No to cream, no to white, or no to Cindy? <laughs> Woo! Squirrels everywhere. Okay, so cream or white? While you guys are deciding that, I'm going to do the blue. So I'm going to skip the cute little wreath, and I'm just going to do the H-O-M-E. Or H-M-E. So I'm going to stir up my chalk paste. And again, Club Couture changes over. Now, that doesn't mean that you can't join at any time during the month. It just means that if you want next month's transfer, you have to add it on, and then you pay the shipping. So... Club members don't pay shipping, but if you add it on, you're technically not a club member until the next month. So, if you want to avoid shipping for Club Couture, you need to join today. Whew. Okay. I just like watching before bedtime, Vicky. Aw, thanks, Cindy. 
Okay, so Cheryl says cream and Terry says white. I need a tiebreaker. While you guys are tie-breaking, I'm going to do our blue. So I'm just going to do the H, the M, and the E on our beautiful 8-inch chalkboard. Cream goes with the flower and white goes with the frame. I know, Linda, Linda, that's my problem. So what do I want to match is the million-dollar question. Do I want to match the frame or do I want to match the flower? I think I want to match the flower because the frame is pretty predominant, right? So do I really want more white? Because then I think the flower is going to look kind of silly. That it's just kind of a cream flower in the middle. It's got nothing to match itself to. That was my thought with the cream. Carol says cream. And I got chalk on the side of my board. So I want to wash that off before it dries. I love these chalkboards. Oh my goodness, I love these chalkboards. Hey, Kathy Moon. Welcome to our chalkboard party. Okay, so I'm going to pull off my transfer. And we're going to have an HME. And a little bit of an O. And a bleed. <laughs> so I take this, I stick it in my water bath, which is right in front of me. And I'm going to do a couple things. I have a bleed. So there's our flower. Again, this chalkboard is magnetic, which is the beautiful one of the many beautiful features of it. I'm going to wash off the chalk paste where I uh, chalked into the transfer that was next to it that I did not want. And then I have a bleed down here. Just going very carefully. Take my Q-tip, run it right along, and eliminate that bleed. Am I going to change the flower? Um, no, I'm not. I'm going to change the whole chalkboard every month with our Club Couture transfer. Probably is my thought process. So that I can be like you guys. Cause you guys are the cool, right? And you get the you get the chalkboard and you get the um, now those of you I, I say you have a one time option to buy the Kickstarter kit. You do only have you have to do the Kickstarter kit when you first join the club because it is a slight discount. It doesn't mean you can't buy this chalkboard you, anybody can buy this chalkboard anytime. It's just when you do it with your Kickstarter kit, there's a slight discount. It's not a huge discount, but it's a, it's a discount nonetheless. And a discount is a discount. This point in time, right? Anything a little bit helps. Okay, so we have our H-O-M-E. And now all we need to do... Vicki said, this is the second time I have seen this on Facebook. It is? Who else did it? I didn't see anybody else make it. Who's copying me? <laughs> okay, I guess... If they did it already. But I didn't copy anybody. <laughs> I didn't even see anybody do this. Huh. Well, for the one time, I don't actually copy somebody. <laughs> I'm going to dry the H, the M, and the E so I don't stick my finger in it. And smudge it. Who else made it, Vicky? All right. So, I'm going to do our welcome to our, and it looks like, Cream, 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 cream. All right, we're going cream. No white. And we're just going to do welcome to our... Make sure it's straight. Stick it on. It's going to be a quick little project. See, I can talk for a really long time. We're 20 minutes, 28 minutes into this. We've played two rounds of Family Feud. I talked for 10 minutes before I even started talking anything. <sighs> Well, you know, you don't really realize how much you need to talk to people until you hit the live button. And then apparently, I really needed to talk to people today. I thought I was having a good day today, too. Until I start yapping at you guys like crazy. Okay, so I'm going to pull this off. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, that was a good color choice because it ties into the flower. Okay, so they're in my water bath in front of me. Wipe off my squeegee right away. I saw a wreath you did for the front door that I did? Did I do a wreath for the front door? What did I do yesterday? Nope. Not me, Vicky. Somebody else. I didn't do a wreath. Wreaths aren't my thing. I, what did I do today? I did, pictures I posted today were of the egg banner that we, um, 
made with the pennants last night and the, oops, this way, this little egg guy. Thank you, Nevada Nicole. Now, a lot of you have this transfer. So this I bought at Target last year, but you know, it's just a little magnet thing and you could totally just switch it up and then you could switch this up seasonally if you chose to. But again, you can just wash it off and remake it every time. You don't have to feel so committed to your home decor, right? You can get creative and be free. All right, let's play one more round of Family Feud because that's the fun, right? Is commenting, commenting, commenting and having less and less of fun. Thank you, Miss Cheryl. Hey, Miss Debbie from Texas. You are just in time for yet one more Family Feud game because we are talking all good things end of month. <laughs> so it's the end of March, people. What's happening today? At midnight today, Mountain Time, ends Transfer Palooza, which is buy three transfers, get one free. Many of you, many, many of you, thank you all, by the way, took advantage of that promotion. It's a great deal. And if you're not sure, oh my gosh, what would I buy three transfers on? Just look at the collections because they have three transfers in them. So like the Birdhouse one, um, the Explore, then there's the Under the Sea one, there's the Farmhouse ones. There's some really nice collections that make it really easy to buy three transfers. So Transfer Palooza which is buy three transfers, get one free, ends at midnight mountain time today. That's the first thing that ends today. The second thing that ends today is Club Couture members, if you are looking to purchase storage solutions that were on sale this month and only club members got this. The transfer tote, the caddy for the inks and the paste and the little accessory bag, those, that sale ends today at midnight mountain time. So two sales end today at mountain time. Got a chunk of chalk here. The other thing is Club Couture. If you want the transfer that as of tomorrow, I'm gonna plaster all over. I don't know what it is until tomorrow. We get we don't get a sneak peek, they don't tell us nothing. I don't even get like anybody get telling me anything. But tomorrow, everybody posts it because it gets posted. So tomorrow I will post this month's Club Couture. If you want that transfer and you do not want to pay shipping. You need to join the club today. After tomorrow, if you join the club, you can still purchase the transfer, but you will pay the shipping. Not a huge deal, but it's still a deal, right? Save every penny that we can, right? Club Couture is $19.99 a month. You get a B-size transfer and three paste packets every month, like magic, in the mail. You can purchase a Kickstarter kit, which has this gorgeous chalkboard in it, which is our 8-in chalkboard. It has the 8-in chalkboard. It has a board and base. It has a white chalk paste, squeegee, multi-purpose tool, board erasers. In the little kit comes everything you need to chalk every month when your little transfer arrives like magic in the mail. Oh, okay, we, oh, I said we were gonna play one more round. <laughs> did I, did, am I forgetting anything? I feel like I'm forgetting something else that ends. Oh, designer. If you've thought about becoming a designer, the kit will refresh tomorrow morning. So don't join today, wait till tomorrow because the, the transfers will be different. They won't be as seasonal. So like right now, the designer kit for right now has the Easter minis in it. Well, obviously that will change because mid month is Easter. So that's what changes in the kit. And usually one or two of the other transfers change. Oops, can't have you seen my answers. Oh, we did that one, that's the monkey one. Ooh, this is a good one. Well, let's, we have two questions here. Which one's better? That one's not good. Okay, you ready? Got your typing fingers ready? Oh, thank you, Kathy Kay. I do like this too. This is I, one of my favorite Club Couture transfers so far. Although I really did like the O Snap one. I didn't like the O Snap part, but I really liked the camera. There's a couple good, there've been a lot of good Club Couture transfers. There's been a few that are like, mm, I'll make that once and never make it again, but mostly, They've been gorgeous, and I've made them over and over again. Okay. Hey, Christine from Michigan. Welcome, welcome. We're playing Family Feud, so get your typing fingers ready. You got to type the answer more than once. Understand that I see it differently than you see it. And if you win, I mail you a fun prize. Okay, you ready? Dun, dun, dun. Name something. Oh, wait. Kathy K says, been so busy sewing masks, haven't had time for much else. I saw that, Kathy. 
Um, there's a couple of you who are have some pretty mad sewing skills and have been very, very generous with your time. So thank you, thank you for helping people. That is just awesome. All right, ready? Here we go. Name something on which name something on which you wish you could get a lifetime oh, guarantee. Okay, I forgot to turn my comments off. Name something you on which you wish you could get a lifetime guarantee. Do you think they could have made that question any harder for me to say? Name something on which you wish you could get a lifetime guarantee. Got my comments turned off. I'm gonna clean up while you guys are commenting away. Comment, comment, comment. Make lots of fun comments. Type, 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 type. Keep typing so that you can knock your poor friend right off of the map. I love my new craft room. So this eight inch chalkboard, now I'm stuck. <laughs> Hang on, I'm stuck. Whose idea was it to put a rug underneath me? Mine, I was trying to save my carpeting. I can't come any further, I'm just gonna move my butt up. <laughs> Whew, it is time to go to bed, ladies. All right, ready? Name something on which you wish you could get a lifetime guarantee. I'm turning my comments back on. Okay, you guys are back. I'm going to watch my phone because it's easier. <laughs> Jennifer. Oh, that is a great answer, Jennifer. Jennifer's answer was marriage. That is number six. Number six is marriage. Wouldn't that be nice? Really, it would be nice. Linda, Linda says health. Eh. I'm going to say no. It's close, but it's not the same. Jennifer says car. Nope. Kathy K says good fortune. Money is number one, two, three, four, number five. Linda squared says health. And I'm going to say no to health. It's close, but it's not the answer. Uh, the answer kind of doesn't make sense, though. Oh, and comments have complete. I'm frozen. Am I frozen? Comments have stopped on both. Have you guys stopped typing? Or did I lose my connection? Hmm. I'm frozen. Frozen, frozen, frozen. I'm frozen, frozen, frozen. Jennifer says happiness. I'm unfrozen now. Okay, nope, not happiness. Hey, Ashton from Texas. Welcome to our chocolate party. Jennifer, it's not happiness. You guys are freezing on me. We're in the middle of a hot game. How can it freeze on me? Oh, Debbie's not frozen. Thank you, Debbie, for telling me that. Cheryl, it's not happiness. Although that is really a good... Never again wait. Carol says never again wait. Never again wait. I don't know what that is. Never again wait. It's not the answer, but what is that? Never again wait. Oh, Linda Linda says not frozen. Okay. Good to know. My screen is frozen. Kathy K, you are the big winner again. Ding, 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 ding. You won twice. Good job. Life. It doesn't make, it doesn't make any sense to me. Name something on which you wish you could get a lifetime guarantee life that's very deep don't you think never gain weight again is that what you mean carol what is never wait again never again wait i gotta think about that one but the answer is life kathy k won kathy you won twice see kathy that's called good karma that's what you get for sewing all those masks <laughs> you win twice <laughs> all right Thank you for playing my game with me. I love playing games. It's so much fun to play games. We do do this kind of regularly. We used to. We haven't done it regularly in a long time. So we should probably get back to playing games. Now that I found, you know, I moved craft rooms, I found my cards. <laughs> so we will get back to playing fun games. Never again W. Hmm. I don't know what that is, Carol. But, you know, that's because my brain has truly gone to... 
um, fourth grade science, social studies, reading, and math. Really is about this the moral to my story. <laughs> Kathy, Kathy. Oh, never. Oh, gain weight. Got it. It's not again. It's gain. Aha. Gotcha now, Carol. <laughs> it's my over fifty eyes that can't read. Yeah. All right. So that was our fun for the evening. This is super adorable. I totally love our color choices. I wish I had better lighting in here. When are you usually on Facebook? Vicki, what do you mean? Like, to message me? It's very hit or miss right now, depending on when they need me. Um, I'm not very busy with them, but I am. I have to be available <clears throat> in case the teacher is needed. <laughs> All fancy. Um, so it's really hard to tell. Um, when I'm done here, I clean up and then I go upstairs, but I'm trying to go to bed earlier than 1 o'clock, which is my normal. But I'm trying to be good. So I will message you, Miss Vicki, when we are done here because you didn't call me back. So if you're going to stick around, I'm going to clean my transfers, go upstairs, and then I will message you. So Club Couture tomorrow, today. Club Couture today. If you want storage solutions today. If you want buy three transfers, get one free today. Um, with videos, Vicki, I go live every night at 9 o'clock Central Standard Time with the exception of Saturdays. Oh, you know what? You're Vicki Hansen. You're not my other Vicki. I am sorry, Vicki Hansen. You're a totally different Vicki, and I'm picking on you about not calling me back. That's the other Vicki that didn't call me back. Vicki Hansen, you're my local friend. Hello, Vicki Hansen. I'm sorry, Vicki. Right? I don't know. I'm confused. I really need to hang up. <sighs> Thanks, guys. I hope you have a super fantastic Wednesday. And I will see you. So, yes, Vicki, I go live every night, 9 o'clock Central Standard Time, except Saturdays. And it's usually between 9 and 9.15 that I hit the live button. It kind of depends on if I'm having technical issues and if what the kids are doing as to what time I go. And I'm sorry I, I confused you with my other friend, Vicki, from Canada. I apologize greatly. You're, you're my local friend, Vicki. Sorry. Too many of you have the same name. It's very hard for me to keep it straight. I'm hanging up now. Oh, wait. No, I'm not hanging up now. If, if you wanted to join the club, or if you wanted to take advantage of Transfer Palooza, you would go to www.chuckcouture.com slash Making Maria. Transfer Palooza, you just order everything, and you get the third transfer, or the fourth transfer is free. You buy three, you get the fourth one for free. You can also, on the top is a button that says club. You can click on club, and that's how you get the information about joining the club. If you want information about the club, you can also comment club, and I would be happy to just message you it directly so that you have it. If you are not in the VIP group, you want to be, because that's where I post my specials, and we do fun things in there as well. So you want to get in the VIP group. All you need to do is comment add me, and I will send you the link so that you can get in the VIP group if you are not there. So if you want information about the club, comment club. If you want information about being a designer because you just want to check it out and see what the heck it all means, you can message me or comment curious and I will send you the information. And again, it's totally up to you if you want to be a designer or not. Um, I'm just happy to help you if it's something you think you want to do. And lastly, if you could please send me out into the world. It helps me a ton when you do that. So thanks, guys. I'll be back at you tomorrow night and I promise I'll try not to be as crazy. <laughs> see ya. <laughs>